The whistleblower, Gary Shapley, a former IRS employee, told the House Oversight Committee that U.S. Attorney David Weiss sought authority to charge Hunter Biden in two federal districts with charges broader than the tax-related misdemeanors that he agreed to plead guilty to. Shapley said that he was assigned to investigate Hunter Biden's financial activities and he found evidence of money laundering, fraud, and foreign influence. He also discovered that Hunter Biden had failed to report millions of dollars in income from his overseas business dealings. Shapley said that he prepared a detailed report and submitted it to his superiors. He expected that Hunter Biden would face serious criminal charges. However, he was shocked when he learned that Weiss, the U.S. attorney for Delaware, had decided to limit the scope of the investigation and only pursue tax evasion charges. Shapley said that Weiss told him that he was under pressure from the Justice Department and the White House to avoid any political controversy. He said that Weiss feared that indicting Hunter Biden on more serious charges would jeopardize his chances of being nominated as a federal judge by President Joe Biden. Shapley said that he felt betrayed and outraged by Weiss's decision. He said that he believed that Weiss had violated his oath of office and obstructed justice. He said that he decided to blow the whistle and expose the meddling with Hunter Biden's case. Shapley said that he contacted the House Oversight Committee and provided them with copies of his report and other documents. He also agreed to testify before the committee and answer any questions they had. Shapley said that he hoped that his testimony would lead to a full investigation and accountability for Hunter Biden and Weiss. He said that he wanted to uphold the rule of law and protect the integrity of the IRS and the Justice Department.